Roblox Squid Game. How to win every game. Hey everyone, how are you all doing? Welcome back to this channel. Today before starting, I would like to ask a question. Could you all play the Roblox Squid Game or just try it out once? According to me, I think each of the Roblox players must have tried it out once since its popularity was so high in recent days. So did you all love the game? I mean all the games that were included like the Red Light Green Light, Shapes Walking, Marbles, Tug of War, and the Glass Bridge. Well, I know all Roblox Squid Games do not possess all these levels, but still, if we combine all the versions that are available to us, then we have tried each one of them at least once, right? In today's video, we will be discussing how to win every game in the Roblox Squid Game. So, if you were unable to finish a game level or just find it hard, then make sure you watch the video till the end. First, we will be starting with the most basic and the easy one called the red light, green light. Of course, some beginners might find it hard too. Well, it is a tricky one, but we have a trick up our sleeves too. All you need to do is just focus on the lyrics of the song. Usually, if you have observed the game, the doll says red light at the end of the song. That means near the end of the song you need to stop. It is that simple. Just concentrate hard and listen well. It will make it easy for you to win this level. Now, shall we move on to level 2? The next level is shape walking. In this game, you will be given a random shape and you need to walk over it to reach the other side. But be careful if you lose balance you might fall. Just make sure you keep moving forward slowly and steadily. You need to have good control over the direction keys, and you will be able to cross this level easily. Besides, we all know, slow and steady wins the race. But yet, do not be so slow that the times run out. Make sure to watch out for it too. Now the third game is a game of pure luck. But with some observation, we can decode its pattern too. The third game is called Marbles, and in this game, you need to guess the total number of marbles you have. Now, we all think it is a game of luck, but if you observe the game, you will realize that the chance of the total number of marbles being even is more. So why not bet on even? Besides, at the end of the day, this game will still be called a game of luck. Okay, so till now we discussed three games. It's time to move on to the fourth one that is the Tug of War. Roblox Tug of War is a really fun game. Know why? Well, because people have some time to curse each other in the text box while pulling the rope. Well, it is one of the most happening games. You feel like you are the only one who is pulling the rope. And trust me, that is the case with everyone else. And more than that, sometimes it is really hard to know which side is winning. It all looks the same. Well, we are not here to discuss the game moments. I am here to tell you how to win at this level. It is easy to just spam the pull button. Wherever it arrives on the screen, just click it, and yeah, make sure you do it fast if you do not want to lose. And yet keep your cool while playing the game. Do not get distracted with all those messages. Also, do you want to know how people sometimes win easily? I told you this before in one of the videos. They cheat? Yes, you heard me, fellow players. Want to know the method? But I wonder if I should tell or not. I mean it is bad to cheat, right? Well, who cares? Let me tell you. Besides, it is a trick you cannot call it cheating. All you need to do is download the auto clicker on your desktop and set it to the highest speed. That's all you need to do. And then you can just sit back and let the program do all the work. If you cannot find how to do it, you can search it on YouTube. You will find it there. Now we will be discussing the last game, and this one is called The Glass Bridge. It is a fairly tricky one because in some Roblox Squid Game versions, you can go and come back without any difficulty, while in some you cannot perform this trick. Well, I will tell you three methods on how to win this level. It is entirely up to you which one you will choose. The first method is to stand back and watch others go first. You will know which one is the safety glass to jump on. But according to my experience usually, this is not the case as everyone is thinking about who will go first. And truth to be told, if we all just wait and see who will go first then, the time will run out and we all will be eliminated. Now the second method is that you jump forward and backward. This way you can check which glass is safe to jump on and which is not. 
although sometimes the glass ball is a seculator, and this leads to misjudgment. Now the third option, which I have yet to try, is walking on the stand that holds the glass together. Although I have seen other players try it, and I have seen them fall. But I'm not sure if this is the case with every game version. So yeah, with this I have told you about all the methods that I knew about. Now it's totally up to you how you will play the game. If you found the video helpful then make sure to like it. Also, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to receive the latest updates. Comment down below to tell us your experience related to the Roblox Squid game. I will see you guys in another video. Till then, I will be signing off.